My name is Minju Kim. Um, I'm a Korean artist based in London. It's been nearly six years since I moved in here, making art, working with love and hate. Because it's quite good to expose yourself in London art-wise, but you can get quite lonely as a foreigner. Not from here, so I'm always been an outsider, even in my country. So, I mean, London is a better place for me, but I don't have any families, or you know, so that's the main struggle point. Apart from that, I like living in London. More opportunities. That's why I'm here. It's good to like expose yourself more than any other country because you can find many interesting people and they're you know, always welcome to you know, look at your artwork and you know, give some good feedback. Like it was quite easier to do group show in London because in Korea it's quite hard to do like like individual like in a personal group shows because all the art scene in Korea is like held by in a big company and big organization. But here, you can find, you know, small ones easily, so... I'm mainly doing um, painting, especially the abstract one and the illustration work. Also, I've been started doing making sculptures as well over two years. And I tend to use a wide range of materials and skills whenever I feel it's suitable for the project. So. I explore the human body both internal and external and uh, kind of try to find the fundamental connection under the theme of desire alongside with concept of life and death. Um, mostly I um, focus on the, the outside of shape and also focus on the inside of organs and the cells and stuff like that and then mix it all together on whatever materials or method I'm using. So. Because, uh, for example, like, because um, people have uh, a different type of desire. Um, someone has um, sexual desire. Some someone has um, hunger for food, and someone has like idea for of um, death as well. Even so, I tend to look at all the possibilities, and then explore. Obsession can be part of it. So, you, you name it, you know. Since I was young, you know, I had like my um, rare body conditions and I had to look through the body um, deeper actually. And then I felt like, you know, so much um, emotional ups and downs onto that, you know, kind of um, struggling moment. And then I feel like, you know, this is also connected with the theme of desire because I desire to have in a better condition so that's why I found some kind of fundamental connection between body and my theme so because I, I liked um, studying anatomy inside the body and I think I'm gonna study more and gonna um, try to uh, transfer those kind of um, knowledge onto my work yeah um, basically um, I have like kind of bone disease and also I've got all sorts of um, weak parts on like basically female part so I had to um, had a long um, medical treatment since I was like five so that became part of my life I mean all of my work is influenced by my um, knowledge and experience, yeah. Um, that work is part of a Mechanical Flesh series and it's basically focused on um, like a shape of um, human cells and ultrasound. It's inspired by ultrasounds and image of human cells and organs. So I tend to, um, how can I say, um, emerge all the information onto the work. Yeah. Because basically that's a paint on the actual female torso and I took a photography 
photograph and uh, I used to, you know, to manipulate the images with the uh, computer and then I print it out like deeper I, I tried to have like a deeper understanding of female body while I was making this piece so and I used uh, all the um, multiple layers of you know skills so um, that's actually um, inspired my favorite film which is um, Taxi Damia and they represent which is my theme as well like desire of human body you know because um, they have like three main characters and the first generation has a sexual desire and the second generation has a hunger for food and the third generation has you know like desire for death actually so and then in the film he actually made himself as a torso and I inspired by that, so I created those things with my body. So. It's like me becoming a living torso, and um, like, how can I say, um, desire for eternal life and ideal life. These are called um, distorted body series, and, and <clears throat> these are the result of me studying anatomical body and I tried to um, recreate the, the human body into, I mean, with my perception. So, the middle of the drawing, and this is actually mermaid by my eye, you know, my perspective. So, I really love this series. I'm, it's an ongoing series, so I'm keep making new uh, drawing works. As an individual artist, I believe BAE um, will give me like, security to protect my artwork and um, connect me to different types of collectors and uh, art lovers with their brand new modern avenue.